Hi, my name is Sky Featherstone, and I'm on our camera business team, where we create camera solutions for business challenges. Today, with advancements in artificial intelligence and computer vision, we're introducing new AR image processing technology so that businesses can leverage the existing product photography they've made and transform it into AR-ready assets for try-on experiences. Through this technology, shoppers can try on outfits more easily from the comfort of their own home, simply by taking a full-body selfie. First, a partner uploads their existing product photography for the product SKUs they sell on their website. Then, Snap automatically applies a new AR image processing technology, which uses deep learning models to transform a retailer's photo into an AR image asset that can be used for try-on. Snap's deep learning models take into account the contours, unique shapes, and edges of the product item to prepare for realistic virtual try-on for the shopper. It dynamically adjusts for each shopper's unique body type, pose, and environment. Finally, businesses can select eligible SKUs with AR image assets to create try-on lenses using new templates in a simple web interface. Rather than needing 3D models to build virtual try-on, businesses simply need AR image assets to build shopping lenses. These lenses can be distributed to shoppers across Snapchat and early access retailer apps and websites that have the technology integrated. We partnered with American Eagle in our early access program to develop this and we are thrilled to see what they've already been able to build. Hi everyone, I'm Ashley Shapiro, the Vice President of Marketing, Media, Performance, and Engagement at American Eagle, also known as All the Fun Stuff. Looking forward to talking today. In the past for us is we've done a lot of testing, whether that's with virtual storefronts or AR and 3D, you know, our team is always learning and testing and having fun with the latest technology. And these are amazing entertainment experiences, but they take time to build. The challenge is, is when you have to do so much work, you have to create 3D assets a lot of times. Um, it's a really big upfront lift. And this technology was able to use our existing product catalog, our own photography, and really just put it at scale. So it was really a turnkey um, solution for us for something that required so much in the upfront. And you know, we couldn't be happier with the results. Yes, we certainly have invested in a lot of AR experiences. Why? Well, AR helps to create a greater world for our community, an innovative one, with experiences that are both commerce enabled and non-commerce enabled, but it's fun. Most important, it's fun, and we want to give our customers a fun experience. In terms of success, if I go back to two years ago, when we did our first store with you, we really thought that the engagement was going to be the key KPI here, but the secret's out and it ended up being a great sales driver. When we closed out, we were at close to $3 million in sales. That's major. Most recently, we launched a tennis game with Coco Gauff. She is the face of our Members Always campaign, where you are able to kind of hit tennis balls of all your favorite clothes from our latest collection. What I loved about this campaign is the share rate. It hit about 40% more than our average and the playtime more than 50% versus our average. And as a marketer, what that tells us is our customer loves it. They're engaging with it and they love it so much that they want to tell other people. And these are the type of KPIs that we continue to get with each of our lenses, with each of the experiences we create with Snap. Our customer loves Snap and our customer loves AE. And the creativity and the innovation of those two things combined is what they want. Snapchat is our customer. It couldn't be a better fit for us as a brand. We are Gen Z, we are youth culture, and that's what Snapchat is. 
Snapchat reaches 90% of 13 to 24 year olds in the US. I think they open the app sometimes like 30 times a day. So Snapchat really allows us to get the scale and reach to drive awareness and reach our customer in a way where they really are already spending their time. It's important for us to provide digital and mobile experiences that allow try-on to our customers because they want to shop however and wherever they want, whether that's in store or it's online, on a desktop, in mobile, in social. They are a digitally and social native generation, and they want a full experience on their phone. So that should include try-on. And when we think about mobile, our mobile sales have grown 30% year on year. So it really does just make sense to allow customers to have that engagement with our brand right in the palm of their hand. Trying on is really the deepest engagement you can have with a product. We all know there's nothing better than slipping on a pair of jeans in a fitting room and seeing if they're the right fit for you. In store, we convert about 60% of our customers once they try something on. So allowing people to do that from the palm of their hand with their phone is so important. And that really should be a tool, a, a technology that really helps them discover our brand, understand it, get the right fits, and ultimately purchase our products. This is taking an experience that you really only used to be able to get in one environment and bringing it wherever you are. Tryon technology really solves the problem of accessibility. This is taking something that previously you had to get in your car or the train or the bus or walk or your bike even to do to allowing you to do it wherever you are. On top of it, we know that our customer is used to instant accessibility, instant gratification. This is a digital and socially native first generation, and they do everything with their phone. Everything happens in the palm of their hand. So this really solves the challenge of, you don't need to be near an AE store. You don't need to get in your car and get there. You can just do it from wherever you are, from your bedroom, from the beach, from the park, from school, not while you're learning. And you can really get the same experience that you could in a store. Yes, we are. It's so impressive how we have been able to leverage the technology, our existing photography, optimize it, and then dynamically map it right on a customer photo. This is the future. Who could have imagined that this is what we could do from our home? So I'm so impressed with the experience we can offer our customers, the entertainment, and really the utility that it's offering us in terms of being able to try on many different fits, many different outfits, um, and even share it with your friends. So scalability is always important to us. When you're the number one jeans brand in the US for men and women 15 to 25 and women of all ages, you gotta keep scale in mind, otherwise, we don't all get to sit in these seats. So with that being said, right now, this type of technology and innovation, it's the wild, wild west, right? We're all having fun. We're all innovating. We're all testing and learning. So it is important. I think the, the question that we're all asking ourselves is when does it become truly scalable? When does this become a true distribution channel for us that we have to think about differently versus just a marketing vehicle. And I, and I think that's coming. I just, I'm not 100% sure when, but it will happen.